like get in bed when the sun is up. I feel like it messes with my sleep schedule. But being like in bed right now just sounds so immaculate. And I'm forcing myself not to lie down because then I will actually not get up. It was my birthday a few days ago. Yeah, I'm 20 now. I feel like my being 18 went for a while and it was fun. It was definitely fun being 18 because I got to do all the things that I was legally allowed to. And then I feel like being 19, well, be, that, the whole year of being 19, I was at home. It was probably like a small, like three, four month period where I actually could leave the house, but we still couldn't do a lot of things. I also feel like the age of being 19 was, 18 I was started to change and then being 19 it was like the, I started to feel comfortable in my skin if that makes any sense. I love to compare myself to others. I don't love it but I can't stop doing it. And I compare myself to other 20 year olds and I think you are an adult, I am not. Because I'm filming myself in bed. And like six people are going to see this anyway. I started using my grandparents old Minolta. I finally got some film and batteries for this bad boy. I've never used it because I'm so scared on how to use it because it is a manual and manuals scare me. But isn't she gorgeous? Hopefully after lockdown I can get it developed and see how shocking they are. That's about it. I've been thinking about this for a while and I kind of want to take out my nose piercing. I got it when I was 18. And I've had it for almost two years. But it gets irritated really, really easily. I didn't like it when it was a um, stud. Um, I only like, like it when there's a ring. And I only like it, I realised, after filming myself and un starting to understand my face. And because of lockdown, you're always staring at yourself. I realise it doesn't look good on a side angle. And also, I know I'm not going to have it when I'm an adult, and I'd rather take it out now and let it heal and have a little scar rather than a big gaping hole in my face. Because it does heal up really, really quickly when I was changing it like a few months ago. Um, it almost healed up in like 20 minutes. And I've been thinking about it for so long, and this morning I woke up and my nose was hurting, so it's kind of a sign. I'm a little scared because I don't. It's going to hurt. I know it's gonna hurt, so I thought, may as well film it. I'm really scared, because it's gonna hurt. But I'm so excited to blow my nose easily and like wash my face and put on moisturizer really easily. I'm stalling. Okay. And it already hurts. I don't know how to dig it out. <sighs> I don't know how to take it out. Can you tell it's already red? I'm going to pause this and then I'll come back. See how long it takes me. Got it. It took me probably like a few tears, but I got it. But you know when like you, you're about to get in the shower and wash your hair and then you look in the mirror and you're like, oh wait, I don't wanna wash my hair or you're about to get a haircut and you're like, hold on, I don't wanna get a haircut anymore. My hair looks really, really good right now. That's me with my nose piercing, but I'm not gonna fully show you because it's really, really gross. It's really, really red. You can even see from that distance, it's really, really red, really, really gross. So I'm just gonna take it out. I'm just gonna take it out. I'm shaking so much. My nose looks huge now. Honestly, knowing me, I'm next week I'm gonna be like, put it back. But the careers that I want in my life can't have a nose piercing.
got my jab this morning at like 9. And I can't tell if it's like giving me an effect or if it's just my period. Whatever it is, it's making me feel a little bit out of sorts. I have a bunch of posters that I ordered very, very start of COVID in 2020. And I ordered a bunch of them and I put them all up on my tilted ceiling. And I took them all down recently because they just made me feel claustrophobic and remind me of lockdown. But I don't know, last night I felt like putting them back up, so they're up. Yesterday I went for a picnic with myself and I had a bagel and a coffee. But this morning I went back to the same place and got the same coffee because it is some of the best coffee I've ever had. Today I'm going to go to the park again and have a little picnic sesh by myself. It's kind of sad because people that go to this park or are having picnics and yesterday there were two groups of students or like playing drinking games and having a fun as time by themselves while I'm sitting on the grass reading Gordon Ramsay autobiography. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I have three books because this is the first time where I've actually started a book and not finished it three times. So I've got my books. I'm gonna go fill up my water bottle. I'm gonna put on some sunscreen. Even though I already put sunscreen on today, I just need to put more on and I'm gonna go read in the sun.